Wow. She's good with words, I'll give her that. She's been sending them all night. I don't know what I'm supposed to say. Don't look at me, I've never sexted before. What? I prefer my sex live and in the flesh, thank you very much. You see, that just doesn't sound fun. Uh, yeah, it would definitely require some flexibility, but I mean, I could see it. You know, maybe you should start actually doing some yoga. Yeah. This would happen. I find someone that I maybe could possibly have a little thing with, and then this happens. Wait, you're not going to meet her now? No. Why not? I mean, hey, at least she didn't send you a dick pic. She doesn't have a dick. Okay, a pussy pic then. That's not a thing. Sure it's a thing. No, it's not. If dick pics are things and pussy pics are things. No, but it rhymes. That's why it's funny. It's a play on words. Dick pic. Alliteration's way funnier than a rhyme. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, if that's lesbian sex, I don't want it anymore. It's not like I think we are going to break up. I just want to be prepared, you know? Yeah. Uh, did she agree to anything? Said she'd have a lawyer draw up some papers. It's fucking ridiculous. I just want to make sure if we break up, I'm going to be able to see my cat. I don't need any legal shit brought into it. It's smart, though. My last girlfriend and I broke up, and I haven't seen the cat in weeks. See, our trouble started with the cat. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna have sex when some animal's staring at me like it knows what I'm doing. Yeah, no, animals should not be in the bedroom. It increases bed death by an exponent of 10. Lesbian bed death isn't real. Yeah, it is. Fuck no, it's not. Do you know how many of my straight friends stopped having sex after the first few years together? Listen, ladies. It's all about pacing. We tire ourselves out in the beginning. Relationship sex is like a long-term marathon. You can't spend the first portion of your relationship having sex seven hours a day and expect it to sustain. Simple math. What do you think? I'm, I'm, I'm allergic to, to cats. Allergic to pussy? What kind of lesbian are you? <laughs> hey! Hi. Whoa, sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. So, um, I've been living by Polly's philosophy. Life. <laughs> what? Our pact. You know, the door open. Right. Sorry. Yeah. No. Uh, have you? Yeah. I'm... Do you have a cat? Oh, no. The, I'm watching her friends. She's so cute, though. Do, do you want to see her? No. Okay. Sorry. Uh, no. No. I just, um, I don't do cats. Right. So. Like you don't do boyfriends. Exactly. exactly. Like I don't do boyfriends. <laughs> er, not quite like I don't do boyfriends. Like, I don't do boyfriends at, at all. Uh-huh. But cats, I could. I, but I haven't because I'm allergic. Right, okay. Um, well, well, another time then. Well, not, yeah, with the cat, obviously, but... If you wanted to come over ever, that would be fun. We could sure. we could have like a neighbor night. Yeah. I'll uh that sounds watch good. a movie or something. Okay. Yeah. Great. Okay. I'll let uh I sorry. Yeah. Okay. No no no, you're fine. I, I understand. Allergies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. All right. Alex? Yeah. People can outgrow allergies, right? Or like, just because I'm allergic now doesn't mean I'm going to be allergic forever, right? I think so. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, I'm sorry. You... Okay. Okay. Thanks. See you later. Bye. Bye. Oh, thank God you're playing yoga. <laughs> How was the meetup? Nothing special. Told you so. <laughs>
And then there's this. Oh my god, she's still at it? Jesus. She keeps sending me a text message every hour. It's like she's waiting for me to have an orgasm or something. You'd think she'd be exhausted. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna take exuberant sapphic sex over some petulant man child any day. What's wrong? Looks like he wants to be exclusive. Does that really be so bad? Hey, he knew before any of this even started what it was gonna be. It's not my fault he went and developed fucking feelings. I think it would be kind of shitty if you missed a good opportunity because you were scared to admit you have feelings for someone. <laughs> I don't have feelings for Luke. <laughs> sure. Okay. Well, why don't you take your own advice? And hey, she's half as good as she says she is one night with her and you'll never need to have sex again. Want me to keep going because I could keep going all night long. This has been lovely, but maybe we could grab coffee. Wouldn't want bed death to catch us before the first date. Winky face. I'm sorry, but that's the most offensive thing I've ever heard. Lesbian bed death is a serious issue and it's not something to be made light of. Is that a yes on the coffee? No. Please don't ever text me again. I just, I don't do cats. Oh, kind of like you don't do boyfriends. Exactly, like I don't, yeah, like I don't do, not quite like I don't do boyfriends. Like I don't do boyfriends like at all, but cats I could, but I haven't because I'm allergic. Okay, another time? <laughs> Sure. Or, well, not with the cat, but I'd love to have you over for wine or something. That you would, know, like yeah. a wine night. Like sure. a wine and Netflix. Okay. Netflix and chill. Yeah. I'm just kidding. That's or am I? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Okay. That sounds good. <laughs>